Hi everyone, this is Diane from the Picket Fence Greenhouse and Gardens and today we're going to talk about the Fern Leaf Bleeding Heart. This is the little flower that's on the Fern Leaf Bleeding Heart and I want to show you something today. I love this plant and for many reasons. It blooms all summer and it sets seeds. Okay, And today I'm going to pick off some seeds and I'm going to show you the little guys and um, these guys always, always have babies every year around the main uh, mother plant there's always little ones coming up so I'm gonna collect some seed but isn't that look at that little heart fern leaf and the, I like this one also because of the fern fern looking uh, bleeding heart look but here right here these are seed pods that are turning brown and tannish um, they're ready I'm gonna pull them off and I'm gonna show you them little they're little black seeds and they're going to be, I'm going to put them away for the winter and try to grow some next spring when I start growing my plants. So let's take these inside and I'll show you the seed right now. Okay, I got the bleeding heart seed pods in here. And there's what they look like in the spring and the summer. And right here is what they look like in the fall. And I'm going to break them open. They're little tiny black seeds. They need to dry a little more. I can feel that. Oops, we even got a little little friend there, a little spider. Okay, but as you can see, the little black, little black little seeds. We let them dry a little bit more. I got a bunch of them, so I think they'll be fine. A lot of them were out there splitting already, so... I hope you enjoyed this video on collecting seeds from your fern leaf bleeding heart. So if you guys got any questions, let me know. This is a really nice fern as it blooms all summer. You guys take care. 